Hello everyone, welcome to join Mimaki webinar. I'm Richard, sales representative from Mimaki Singapore. Before I start the webinar, I would like to thank our value distributor and customer for taking your time to join our webinars. If you have joined our previous webinar, you might have some better understanding of Mimaki Inject Printer. Today, we will talk about the window for application on Mimaki Inject Printer. As more of the window phone are transparent media, Mimaki row to row inject printer are equipped with white ink. With the white ink attached, various applications can be achieved, which I think is good for customers to explore new market. These are the Mimaki printer with white ink. We are talking about the printers up to 1.6 meter only. We also have 3.2 meter printer with white ink, but we will not talk about that today. We only talk about 1.6 meter printers today. We can put the machine into four category: eco oven or UV, printer only or print and cut. Difference between print only machine and print and cut machine is simply whether it has cutting unit or not. If you have print and cut model, you can save space. But if you want production, it's better to have a separate cutting plotter. When we talk about white ink. More important thing is whether you take eco solvent or UV printer. Let me introduce the Mimaki row to row printer with white ink. This is eco solvent print only machine JV300 Plus. The original JV300 was released in 2014 and we released the upgraded version of JV300 Plus in 2019. Because of print and cut, we have two machines, CJV300 Plus and CJV150. This is CJV300 Plus. And we have UV printers. This is UV print only machine, UJV100-160. And this is Mimaki latest model. This is UV print and cut machine, UCJV300, which we released in 2017. Eco solvent and UV have both advantages and disadvantages. About cost. In general, eco solvent ink is cheaper. So if you only talk about the ink cost, maybe eco solvent is better. But when we talk about the cost of media, UV printer also have advantage because you can print on many cheap material without ink receiving layers. So we cannot say too much about the cost. You need to consider the cost of the material too. The second one is media compatibility. UV printer has advantage on this one. As you know, eco solvent ink get into the material, so the material has to have ink receiving layer. UV ink is cured on the media, so material doesn't need to have ink receiving layer, so you can print much more different type of media if you have a UV printer. Third one is delivery times. UV ink win on this one too, because UV printing doesn't need to have drying time. You can move on to the next step right after printing. Number four is about scratch resistance. Because eco solvent ink get into the media, it is stronger. Number five is durability. According to our lab test, eco solvent ink has better outdoor durability. Number six is laminate. The printed surface of eco solvent is flat, so you can laminate very easily. The printed surface of UV ink is not flat because UV ink is cured on the surface. So, if you use a normal cold laminate, air gets in and finish is not good. So, warm laminator is needed and laminate firm has to have thick glue layers. Please be careful about this one. Again, eco solvent and UV has both advantage and disadvantage. We have different types of eco solvent ink, but only SS21 and ES3 have white ink. Both ink are very high quality, and especially SS21 ink is one of our best selling ink in Europe, the US, and in Japan. But the problem is the cost. 
actually we are not selling so much of this ink in Southeast region because of the cost. So unfortunately, we cannot recommend our Eco Solvent printer for white ink application. We recommend our UV printer instead. These are our UV printers. UJV100 is print only and UCJV300 is print and cut. I will talk about the differences between this model because the difference is not just whether it is print and cut machine or not. Firstly, the concept. UJV100 is simple. This is print only machine and can only print two layers, color and white, two layers. UCJV300 is versatile. This is print and cut model and you can do three layers, four layers and five layer printing. Combining clear ink and white ink is also possible. So, if you want to accept a lot of different type of job, UCJV300 is your choice. About the cost, UJV100 is much more affordable, both machine and ink, about 20 to 30% lower than UCJV300. So, if you have fixed application, UJV100 is better. Ink are different too. For UJV100, it is LUS210 and available in 4 colors plus white and clear. For UCJV300, the ink is LUS175 and color are 6 color plus white and clear. We also have LUS200 ink for UCJV300. This ink is developed by 3M for their MCS warranty. If you are interested in MCS warranty, please check with your 3M media suppliers. LUS 210 and LUS 175 have similar characteristics, but the cost is different. LUS 210 cost is about 20 to 30% lower than LUS 175. Print heads are different too, but the important thing is the difference of arrangement. UJV 100 is staggered arrangement, and UCJV 300 is in inline arrangement, and there are advantages and disadvantages. UJV100 is staggered arrangement and printing speed for 2 layer printing is good but you cannot print in 3 layer, 4 layer or 5 layers. UCJV300 is in inline arrangement and this is good to print in multiple layers. You can print in 3 layers, 4 layer, 5 layers but the print speed of 2 layer is not so high. These are the print speed in colors plus white 2 layer print. As you can see, the printing speed of UJV100 is about 50% to 70% faster than UCJV300. Also, another difference is that UJV100 has dot adjustment system and printer can do adjustment for X direction and Y direction automatically. This is newly developed for UJV100 and UCJV300 doesn't have this function. So, in short, we would like to recommend our UV printer, UJV100 or UCJV300 for your white ink application. Both printers are good for window graphics as well as other regular signage printing including backlit application. Which machine you want to take depends on your variety of application. If you have fixed application, UJV100 is better because the cost is lower for machine and ink. If you want to accept many different job types, UCJV300 is better. You can print in many layers for special abstractions. We would like to show you some video with the printing process and some more samples that we made using our UV printer. This is the platform of Mimaki Raster Link 6 Plus software. I will show you on how to create white layer for two layer printing. First, you need to load the data into our Raster Link 6 Plus RIP software. It can be PDF. EPF or any supported formats. From the top of the left menu in our Raster Link 6 Plus, select File, Open, choose the data that you want to input into the Raster Link, as you can see the data is already input. Second, we need to configure the print setting uh, for white layers. Select special plate, select white ink, and choose the percentage of white ink that you decide to use. Select valid pixel because we want to put the white layer under the color data. Select create. 
as you can see the white layers is already correct now we will go down to convert zip the jobs please highlight both of the job and select composite icon assign each layer into the correct position and select composite now the job both of the job is already composite so before we proceed for printing process we need to choose the correct uh, resu uh, prof color profile data select quality choosing the select the media profile that you want to use and decide what kind of resolution that you're planning to for printing once you've already done all the print quality setting you can uh, execute printing process by select the execution and select read and print and press start for printing process this is Mimaki UJV 100-160UV inject printer in 4 colors plus 1 ink set we use transparent media for two layers printing. The printing sequence will be white followed by color layers. We are using resolution 360 by 1200 dpi with 8 pass print mode. UJV 160 print head are in staggered arrangement. So the printing speed for two layer printing will be 50% higher than UCJV 300. Clear ink will be available within 2020, which I think is good for customers to expand their market. In this video, we will show you three layers printing on UCJV 300 for window foam clear sticker. We are using resolution 600 by 600 dpi with 16 pass print mode. The printing sequence will be color Y and followed by color layers. Do note that the video has been fast forward 50 times. This application is good for window from front and back images. As clear ink is available, combining white color and clear ink to perform three layer printing is also possible. In this video, we will show you UCJV 300's 4 layer printing on window phone clear sticker. We are using resolution 600 by 600 dpi with 16 pass print mode. The printing sequence will be color, white, gray and followed by color as last layers. This application is for day and night effect. By over printing a total of 4 layers, making use of this effect can change the impression of the picture between when the light is on and off. Lastly, we will show you UCJV 5 layer printing on window foam clear sticker. We are using resolution 600 by 600 dpi with 16 pass print mode. The printing sequence will be color, white, black, white and followed by color as last layers. The difference between 4 and 5 layer is there is a black layer in the middle which allows to block out the images. By overprinting a total of 5 layers, 
Different picture can be shown on the front and back on a sheet of media. As Mimaki UV inject printer is equipped with white ink, create high added value job is possible. Customer can expect their applications such as Christmas and New Year's decoration. Customer may answer what they need to take note while application. Is it okay to apply window film with water? The answer is yes. No effect in normal use. Mimaki have done some tests on Lintec with window film application. The water can get cloudy when the surface of the printing with LUS-175 is repeatedly rubbed by Sweezy. Please wipe the water so the water does not leave mark. It is recommended to use the squeezy with rollers. Is it okay to use glass cleaner on printing? The answer is yes. We have done some tests by using above cleaner. Ink doesn't peel off due to acidity and alkalines. But please take note, it is recommended to test the glass cleaner before apply. It is also advised to apply laminate firms on printing to protect the surface while applying.